Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome you all to Skyrim on the Xbox Series X. FPS Boost Mode came out for this game yesterday, along with Fallout 4, which I'm also going to do some on, possibly some Prey and Dishonored 1, I think it was. Yeah, Dishonored 1, I think. Which I have downloading at the moment as well to try that out. For anyone that doesn't know what FPS Boost Mode is, it is a backward compatibility feature that Microsoft have just started putting onto the backward compatible games. And by backward compatible, obviously, we mean the Xbox One games now. And if you want to turn on FPS Boost Mode or know that it's there, just go to your game in here or in your library and go to Manage Game and Add-ons. And you'll have over on the left-hand side here, you'll have Compatibility Options. Click on that. There's a HDR one there, which isn't available here for this game. And there's FPS Boost. Just tick that box if it's not ticked. And you will have double the frame rates of the game that you want to play. So we're going to try it out. We'd already tried this game out with the 60 FPS uncapped mod on, which was a bit stuttery in places, to say the least. So I'm hoping this is going to be a far smoother experience. Let's crack straight in. New game, yes, please. Now I'm playing this on the... PlayStation 5 at the minute with a mod on it for 60 FPS as well. So I'm going to try and play this exactly the same so I can do a nice good comparison of the two. How many times have I come down this road? Skyrim. Quest journal list your quests. That normally doesn't come up there, does it? Very strange. Hey, you. You're finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Walk right into that Imperial ambush. Same Maybe. And that thief over there. Damn you, Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. If they hadn't been looking for you, you could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there, you and me, we shouldn't be here. It's the Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in binds now, thief. Shut up back there. <laughs> Shut up back there. Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? The Jarl Windhelm? You're the leader of the rebellion. But if they captured you... Oh, gods. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going. But Sovereign Guard awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. See the color popping in? Hey. What village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should leave home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Welcome to your doom. Sure. Mara, Dibella, Kinnereff, Akatosh, Divines, please help me. Look at him. General Tully is the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. Certainly very smooth thus far. Gorgeous. This is Helgen. I used to be sweet on a girl from here. <laughs> I wonder if Vilod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Funny. When I was a boy, imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. I was once sweet on a girl from Helgen. Why? I want to watch the soldiers. Be 
inside the house. Now. Here we go. Get these prisoners out of the cars. Move it. Why are we stopping? Why do you think? End of the line. End of the line, my friend. Let's go. Right, we'll try and do this first bit as quickly as we can with the character creation. Not stuck in it for too long. Face your death with some courage. You've got to tell them we weren't with you. This is a mistake. Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time. Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Raylof of Riverwood. Go on, Braylof, my friend. Lokir of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel. <laughs> can't do this. Halt! <laughs> Run! Archers! How's it going to die this time? Anyone else? Oh. <laughs> Wait. Nice. You there. Last time he did the splits while moving. Who are you? Who are you? Right, okay. Well, I shall go with my normal... <laughs> I say this, and then I'll probably forget... Uh... Yeah, it is Brett and I think. In addition to their quick and perceptive grasp of spellcraft, even the humblest of High Rocks Bretons can boast a resistance to magic. Bretons can call upon the dragon skin power to absorb spells. Oh, really? Nice. Right, I'm pretty sure that's the one we went with. Normally. Yeah. Hey, where's the... I thought I picked sex before I did that. Oh, there we go. Let's try and go with the same character I created on PlayStation 5-ish. I'm pretty sure I kept all the presets apart from changing the colour of the hair, really. Possibly the eyes. Face! Well, the eyes, I tell you, the eyes, where are they? Here we go. Eye colour. Because obviously we'll be looking at their eyes a lot while we're playing the game, you know what I mean? <laughs> You're going to see loads of their eyes, people. I might actually stick with the ones that were there, to be fair. Go with those ones. Go with those for now. Right. Brow. Mouth. Hair. Colour. Go with a nice red, I think. Right, I think we're good to go. Does it knock it if you've changed the presets? Does it change the colours? Alright, yeah, it does. Right, let's go. Right, well, normally we go with Sky was my default normally, but I was quite keen on the old Sonja that we used in the PlayStation, so let's use that. Sonja. Are you from Daggerfall, Breton? Fleeing from some court intrigue? Captain, what should we do? She's not on the list. Forget the list. She goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. Oh, she's a hard woman. Sorry. We'll make sure you have a man so return to High Rock. So you should. Follow the captain, prisoner. <laughs> oh, 
Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. Oh, here it comes. What was that? It's nothing. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Aetherius, blessings of the eight divines upon you. For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over <laughs> Dude, if you just hung off, the dragon would have saved your life, dude. Come on, I haven't got Tell him every time. Every time I tell him. But does he listen? No. Off with his head. Are smiling at me, Imperials. And you say the same. It's a clean, clean cut, though. Quick. Still not going to take that head out of the basket, are they? Every time. Death to the Stormcloaks. As fearless in death as he was in life. Next, the Breton. Oh, me, is it? There it is again. Did you hear that? I said, next prisoner. To the block, prisoner. Nice and easy. Go on, dude. Like, you know what I mean? Take the head out for me, dragon! Holy shit. Let's go. I'm following you, dude. Think? No! Get to the chopper! <laughs> I'm following you, dude. Come on. This way, friends. Move! Just need to move some of these rocks to clear the floor. Today, Jesus. Fire! See the inn on the other side. Jump through the roof and keep going. Really? Woo! Please. And my hands are supposed to be tied, aren't they? It's you and me, prisoner. Stay close. Follow the storm cloak. We'll meet again in Solemn Guard, brother. 
Looks like we're the only ones who made it. That thing was a dragon, no doubt. Just like the children's stories and the legends. The harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. Yes, untie me, please. There you go. You may as well take Gunyar's gear. He won't be needing it anymore. Sorry, Gunyar. But, you know, needs must, my friend. I'll take an axe. Better than note. All right. Let's get our kit on. Also, pretty sure we start with some magics here. Sexual healing. Get that armor on. Give that axe a few swings. Nice. Some way out of here. Ah, this one's locked. Let's see about that gate. Well, so far, so smooth. Oh, you can never quite tell in that first bit if it's 100% smooth or not because of all the rumbling and things going on. The real tester when we get to where there's trees, mist and water and fire and smoke. Have it. One handed increased. Nice. Ow. Whew. Maybe one of these Imperials had the key. I'm pretty sure that's heavy armor that they've got on. Uh, Helden Keep. Well, really? Yeah, we need the key, don't we, to get through the door? That's all heavy. I don't want heavy. The imperial sword. The imperial sword might be all right though. See if it unlocks. Let's get herself out here. Yeah, the Imperial stuff's just that little bit better, isn't it? 23 against... 25. Door. Well, we look like a bloody Imperial now, for sure. Actually, just before... See if you can unlock that door. It is done, my friend, although I wanted to just check through here. Chest! Well, I've already got one of them. And we've already got those. Coin. Well, certainly smooth in the indoor areas. I've actually uninstalled the, the mods that I did use when I tried the 60 FPS uncap on. I mean, this is effectively 60 FPS. The game was built at 30, so... And they say FPS boost mode doubles the... ...frame rate. Damn, that dragon doesn't give up easy. Mm, does not. Have everything important and let's move. Dragon's burning everything to the ground. Hang on, before we can do that, pretty sure I've got a better weapon than this.
And also, oh, the damage is the same as it happens. Pretty sure I've got fire as well. Alright. We need to gather some more potions. Nice. My magic is low, yes, yeah, well, it's because I've not got half magic yet. See if you can find any potions. We'll need them. They're making a conscious decision to not pick up all the armor and stuff for selling because they just can't be bothered. <laughs> it's like, we'll take other things that we can sell, me thinks. That said, I mean, there's a, a lot of benefit to it. Gets your uh, speech up and stuff if you keep selling loads of stuffs. It's a fair point, uh, actually, because when I get to the blacksmith... That's all heavy, isn't it? I can carry 300. That shut us off from the last one. That's not done. Right, onward. Open the door. Let's get moving. Troll's blood. It's a torture room. Hear that? Come on. Hey. That's your back. Was Jarl Ulfric with you? No. Yeah, I mean, we're getting heavy quick with those weapons. Right. Leave the weapons behind, just pick up the light armor. Wait a second. No lock picks. Something in this cage. Ah, it's locked. Attempt to pick the lock to the cage. See if you get it open with some picks. We might need the gold once we get out. Grab anything useful and let's go. Come on now, really? Lovely. Sparks straight off the bat. Never actually tried just putting that Mage stuff straight on. I was a bit worried there's no armor on it. Oh, it actually gave me 15 lot picks there. Not bad, isn't it? No, 16. Right! I'm surprised we didn't get a lot pick level up there. Are we done? We are. Let's go. Why you not go? Oh, you are. Hey, there we go.
Easy money. Eight gold? Where's that skeleton keeping his gold? Seriously, what's that thing? Imperial dogs. There's Where? nothing that's too low for them. Orders are to wait until General Tullius arrives. I'm not waiting to be killed by a drag. We need to fall back. Fight. He's down. Not much in the way of gold, these fellas, have they? them oh in the back flanked and spanked not overly sure how much more of that light armor we can manage see if the way is clear Oh, dude. Man down! I'm pretty sure I always come looking down here and there's never anything down here. Come on, this way. Let's see where this goes. That dragon ain't for giving up. Pretty sure. Oh no, it's spiders first, net. to go this way yes it's pretty much bear time I think Let's do the same thing every time with this bear if I can manage it Nice. <laughs> Sweet. Don't you worry, my friend. I've got us covered. 
<laughs> sneaking is overrated, eh? <laughs> Something like that, my friend. Yeah, not too far from it now, then, I think. It's a bit late with the command to sneak there. Here we go. Let's see what Skyrim look like. Wow. How quick was that as well? There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. We better clear out of here. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. You would not have made it without my help, that is for damn sure, my friend. Okay, it's all right here. It was a little bit sticky when we came out the cave there for the first time, but it seems to be all right. Join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here today. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's over. Join the Stormcloak Rebellion. Check that out. Let me just take that fire off for a sec. See that ruin up there? The stones. Mage stone. Thief stone. Well, they're kind of self-explanatory. Those under the sign of the thief will learn to stealth skills 20% faster. Those under the warrior stone will learn all combat skills 20% faster. And those under the mage will learn all magic skills 20% faster. Which is what we're taking. These are the Guardian Stones. Three of the 13 ancient standing stones that dock Skyrim's plants. Mage, eh? Well, to each his own. It's not for me to judge. <laughs> no, it's not. Not for you to judge at all. that beautiful I'm not sure what this pulled the graphics down to with FPS mode but if we're ahead of the news from Helgen we should be fine as long as we don't do anything stupid if we run into any Imperials just let me do the talk right? seems reasonable see the fish is jumping out the water there Free leather. I'm glad you decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. Yeah, I have to say, I'm not overly impressed at the moment. I'm finding it very sticky in places that it wasn't sticky with the mod. Like, I don't remember it being sticky here at all when I put the uncap on. 
So, and it's jittering about. And it seems to be doing it fairly regularly while I'm running as well, which it doesn't do. It didn't do that at this particular stage on the mod, on the uncapped mod. And if it's struggling at this point, it's not going to get much better because it gets more and more intense in the world. What? What is it now, Mother? It was as big as the mountain and black as night. It flew right over the barrel. Dragons now, is it? Please, Mother. If you keep on like this, everyone in town will think you're crazy. And I've got better things to do than listen to more of your fantasies. You'll see. It was a dragon. It'll kill us all and then you'll believe me. <laughs> we'll all be dead, it'll kill us and then you'll see. Like, it's kind of all right there. I mean, I'm not sure what the... What graphical... Because they said what they've done is they pull the graphics back in order to give you the FPS boost. But... If that's been pulled back to 1080p and it's still struggling, I'm quite surprised. And it's a bit... As I say, it's a bit odd because the... The mod, the 60 FPS mod, seemed to be happier with it. Did I see you talking to Sven? Maybe not. Maybe never mind. But I would stay away from him if I were you. Okay. Whatever you need. Buy you smear if it's simple and strong. I can afford it. She might go and see Gerder first. before you'll be joining the fight yourself. That's right. Don't worry, Uncle Rayla. I won't let See, so nice and smooth there. No, Rayla. Yeah, it doesn't like that. You two look pretty well done here. It gets sticky when you go past that wheel that it's got the steam coming off it. Well, the news you heard about so... Yeah, I'm not sure about that one. It'd be interesting to see how Fallout 4 deals with it all, with it being a newer game. But, I mean, I did not have any of that when I was playing it on the Uncap FPS mod. So I'm not sure why FPS Boost is having a little bit of a moment with it. Could be they try and smooth it out if people mention it. I mean, you know, I would still play it at this rather than 30 frames per second. I mean, I couldn't go back to 30. But if it's already having a bit of a moment with mist and stuff there, then they'll certainly have issues with bigger areas in the game that have got more going on. But be interesting to see what Digital Foundry make of it. But... I mean, just in general, when you start running and then just move the camera to the left or right, you just get a little jitter here and there when you start doing it. More than happy in the water. I mean, when it does it, it does it really well. <laughs> the problem is when it when it doesn't want to do it, you get a very sticky moment. Have little things like that where the water's bouncing off the bridge as it's running through. That said, it is super smooth when it does it well, though. Let's have a quick chat with Gerder. She says we can use the house. Trade is that thieves broke into his store. Strange. He says they hardly took anything. Yeah. 
Do you have any supplies I could take? Use the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. Thank if you. anything else you need, just let me know. That's very kind. Yeah, I'll take a garnet off. Yeah, that's lovely. And a silver ring. Very kind lady. Well, could sell the mead, I suppose. There is something you could do for me. Oh, okay. For all of us here. A fine day to you, friend. May you die with a sword in your hands. We're a small village, but we work hard and take care of our own. How do I get to White Run from here? What can you tell about Riverwood? Is there somewhere I can? Well, she just said there's something you can do for us. I'm not sure what Until she's saying. She's still got a thing on her head. Did I see you talking to Sven? Maybe not. I own the lumber Maybe. mill and pay a Never. fair wage. But I would stay away from See my husband way. Hod if you're looking for work. All oh, right. Okay. All right then. <laughs> What's the quest though? Talk to Gerda of Riverwood. I just did. Only worry we've got. Of course. Must be a specific conversation. For all of us here. Yes. Well, tell me what it is. Cross the river and then head north. You'll see White Run on it. It's my mill. Some folks think it's my town too, but it ain't. The Jarl in White Run owns the land and the town. I just pay the taxes. Somewhere I can buy fresh supplies. By supplies? I suppose you mean weapons and armor? Alvor can help you out. He's our blacksmith. Hmm, she's not for telling me what she wants, is she? What's that all about? I don't remember that being an issue. Just go and speak to her and bloody things she no, kick off, isn't it? of things I can't change. Too much work to be done. All right, then. Well, one of us has to Loading screens are just ridiculously fast, though, aren't they? No, no adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh, <clears throat> a customer. <laughs> Sorry you had to hear that. Yeah, well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. Something happen? Uh, yeah, we, we did have a, a bit of a, a break-in, but we, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament, solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. I could get you back. You could? Yeah. I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Blue The Claw. Northeast of town. Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Well, no, I... By the eight, fine. But only to the edge of town. <laughs> a guide to walk me up the path to the bridge. Right, I need to sell you my stuff anyway. Show those thieves not to steal... Trinkets, odds and ends. That sort of thing. Hey, what am I wearing then? Light boots, light braces, light helmet. Oh, studded Imperial armor. Get a fast bit of coin.
Let's learn our spell. Until next time, the sooner you f Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Yeah, what does he have off the bat? Nothing too major, is it? Ray Zombie, Oak Flesh, Lesser Ward, Fury, Flash, Clairvoyance. Well, that got us a bit of a coin. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see Could do a bloody Alva telling me what it is she wants from me. We're a small village, but we work hard and take care of. <laughs> <laughs> Until next time. That's just weird. I think that's bugged out. She should be telling me what she wants, surely. I the lumber mill and pay a fair wage. See my husband hard if you're looking for work. Right, well, I think we'll leave it there. The next stage for me would be to, well, firstly get that to activate, which it's not doing for some reason. I mean, yeah, I mean, I would certainly play that. With the FPS boost on before I play it at 30 frames per second without any shadow of a doubt. Is it 100% smooth? Not from what I've just tried out there. But certainly a lot better than 30 frames per second without any shadow of a doubt. I'm still convinced that the uncap FPS mod was smoother. But, you know, FPS boost might be something they can twiddle with. Maybe rein those graphics in that teeny bit more if they need to to get it more smooth. I mean... It feels like it's slightly more than 1080p to me, so. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. This is the bridge out of town. The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls Barrow. I guess I should get back to my brother. Yeah. Fit if I take too long. I think you're probably right. Okay. Well, there you go. It's probably an ideal place to wrap it up, actually, for just showing off the FPS boost. I'm certainly going to carry on my PlayStation 5 playthrough, which is also using a mod. But with that particular mod, you can... Well, with both of those mods, you can click it so that you're still getting your achievements and trophies oh, and such like. See, even there, when I was running past that smoke and I tried to turn at the same time, it went a bit jittery on me there, just a little bit. Just where the fire's coming out of his blacksmithing. So, there you go. Well, I hope that's helped somebody out to see how well it's playing. It has been an honour and a privilege serving for you in Skyrim on the Xbox Series X with FPS boost mode on, and I shall catch you in the next one, folks. Take it easy. Bye.